This is a quick guide to accessing and searching the FT.com at the University of Hertfordshire. To access the FT.com, come into StudyNet, click on the online library tab. You can either scroll down to the subject toolkit for business and then access it in the specialist database area or from underneath the library search box, click the A to Z list of search sources and scroll down to ft.com. Once you're into the FT, you can register as a user and uh, this will allow you to save certain settings um, and identify areas that you are going to be regularly interested in so that you're kept up to date. To do a simple search, simply click on the magnifying glass and it opens a search box. So if I am interested in, uh, say, US foreign policy, I can simply type that in the box and either hit return or you see it's given me an option here to see all news matching US foreign policy. There's quite a number there. We have um, over 187,000 hits. We might be able to refine this. If we look at the need some help searching and view hints and tips, pop open the box and you can see some suggestions there for making your search a little tighter. If you have a phrase like US foreign policy, you can put it in double quotes to search for an exact match. So if we try that, let's see how many hits we retrieve. That's brought it right down to nearly 3000 hits. And again, if we want to pick it up as a topic heading, we can pick it up from the related topics point. We can make the search a bit more specific again by adding in additional search terms. So let's have a look again at the hints and tips. And it suggests combining searches with Boolean operators and, or, or not. If we use the Boolean and, it means that most search ter both search terms must occur in the record that's retrieved in the article that's retrieved. So if I say US foreign policy and Middle East and hit search. Again, I've narrowed down the number of hits to just over 1100 and you can scroll down. Again, you've got an option to save those to your FT if you've registered or just scroll through picking out the ones you want to look at in more detail. To look at the um, actual article, simply click on the article you're interested in and you'll be presented with the full text. You can also use some of the headings at the top to drill down into FT content. So if I'm interested in issues like foreign policy and so on, I go into the world section and I can look for the global economy, issues around the UK, US, China, Africa and so on and simply drill down for stories that have appeared regarding those countries. The search function is very simple and you often do retrieve quite a few hits but it, it is functional and worth uh, trying. If you know a specific author I would suggest using that along with some of the title words to identify articles. To give you an example there's a specific article I'm interested uh, in 
by Janin on uh, the new silk road. And again, I'm going to put new silk road in as a phrase because I know that that's a, a phrase that is used. Let's put that in again. Shannon and New Silk Road. And there is uh, the article I'm interested in. And I can simply open that up. So the ft.com contains a wealth of news articles uh, particularly useful if you are interested in business, economics and politics.